All right, the objective of this tutorial is to learn how to make changes to a Google Doc as suggestions, not permanent edits. So what do I mean by this? Let's say if someone is writing a document or you have written a document and want to share the document to someone else and get their inputs as well, not as these irritating comments that you see here, because a comment can only be given as text and then you need to read it and then change. Google Docs gives us a feature that's one step better. It is kindly related to track changes in MS Word, but in a different way. Let me let us do this rather than just talk. So first thing that we need to do is go right here. This is a permanent option in Google Doc. Change from editing. Editing is where you are editing a document. You are permanently making the change in a document. Instead, change this to suggesting. So once this is in suggesting mode, anything that you do to a document is taken as a temporary edit and the author or the final approver of the document can either accept your suggest or reject it. In this case, let us be the suggester as well as the approver. Let's see how this works. Let's say I want to delete this one. I click delete and this is how it would appear. It says it's deleted. Let's say this is someone else doing the work on your document and you are the one who's going to review this. You can either accept this or reject this. Once you reject, the delete is reverted. But if you accept that, the content is deleted. And you can make changes in suggesting mode as much as you want. Let's write something. Everything, each and every change that you make, even if you add a line space, you bold something, Italicize, you link. All of these are taken as suggestions. Do not confuse these with your comments. They look similar in their user experience, but these act as suggestions. And let's say you have done all your suggestions. What would you do? You would share this with any of your contacts that you want, copy the link and just share the link. And once the final approver, the reviewer opens up the link, he or she can just go look at the change that you have done can either accept or deny the change or can even give you feedback. Yes, track changes in MS Word is much takes a much deeper dive, but this is what we have in Google Docs and I personally did find this useful. And once you go back to editing, your changes are permanent. Hope this helps the ones who work in a collaborative environment. And thank you. Ask any questions, use the comment section. Bye bye.